The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. This is CNEagles.com. I'm Matthew Osborne, she has Carson and swim coach Paige McCord. Eagles announced their schedule today, Paige. And first off, we'll start off with the beginning of the season. You go to Cumberland, you go to Limestone, two road matches to start off the season. What's going to be the key to that? Start off the year with two wins. Sure, absolutely. We're going to get out uh, quickly and have some competitive events against Cumberland and also go head-to-head -head with Limestone. It'll be really key for us to see where our athletes are at at the beginning of the season. Looking forward to the opportunity. Middle of November, right before Thanksgiving, you go to Georgia Tech for the Georgia Tech Mid-Season mid Invitational. You leave the fall frenzy. What was the key to make that decision to leave the fall frenzy and go down against and swimming against the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets and a lot of other Division One teams? Mm -hmm. Yes. Well, first off, the, the first thing is that fall frenzy was shifted weekends due to pool renovations. And secondly, the level of competition is a little bit higher, um, believe it or not, at the uh, Georgia Tech. We'll, we will be racing against uh, University of Alabama, University of Arkansas, South Carolina, University and uh, Indian River. So we'll have some strong competition there. Additionally, uh, we've got some fans for Carson Newman down in the Georgia area. So just a fun area for us to get down and um, have a good prelim final swims. Right before Christmas break, you host Bellarmine, the only regular season home meet this season. You also, of course, host the Triple Splash. What's, gonna, what's Bellarmine going to bring to the table in mid-December? Sure. Well, it'll bring an interesting aspect. We've not had a meet at home that late, but we did that on purpose to keep some of the um, – uh, some of the excitement in the tougher part of Christmas training. Um, also, it'll be good to see where our athletes are about midway through. So we're excited to bring a strong team like Bellarmine here and uh, definitely have a great uh, time to, to host them here. It'll be wonderful. In January, you get three meets. You go down to Cocoa Beach to swim in your normal winter training meet, and then right. you, you get the try meet against King and Emory Henry, and then you go to Catawba. That stretch right before conference is always key. What's going to be the key about those three meets? Are you going to be looking for new swimmers in that specific sequence? Well, specifically those three events will be two-night meets before we get to conference. Kind of uh, At that point, we will be able to re really refine which athletes will be suited best to individual events. We do have quite a few new freshmen, and so it will be um, interesting over every meet to see where they really find their best niche for both the, the team and also individually. Um, so I think that combination of three meets will really help us as we prepare for conference. You bring up conference in the middle of February, reigning national champions, Queens, Wingate, Limestone, three perennial powers will be there at the BMCs. What's going to be the key for you to make another step forward as you did last season? Absolutely. Well, our team goals is definitely um, we would like to place in the top three for sure. And I think to do that, we've got to be deep in the, the final eight. Um, several people need to make shifts up. And I think in order to make that happen, uh, we've got critical technique changes and also a lot of anaerobic power development and aerobic capacity development that is very essential to us. Um, also, I think that we have really strong pieces right now in play as well as our strong relays. So it should be a very, very exciting year for us. And um, that's one of the reasons we're going to Georgia Tech when we do so we can practice swimming fast in the morning because, uh, of course, that's the key, getting back at night top eight. Well, thanks for your time, Coach, and good luck. Thank you. Carson Swim Coach, Paige McCord, I'm Matthew Osborne, and this is CNEagles.com.